Hey, Ike. This is your field recruiter, Topu Jimmy, coming at you from Rock Springs, Wyoming. Look at this bonehead trucker blocking the <laughs> fuel island, and this guy can't even get through. So we're gonna wait until this guy pulls forward. We're gonna ask him why he's blocking the fuel island. There's the driver. He had to go get himself a Saudi water and a cheeseburger probably he's got a little bag in there you know look at him look at him i'm a, I'm a super trucker i got a super truck and i gotta block the fuel island because i'm a super trucker in a super truck look at me i'm, I'm a bonehead trucker and i guarantee you he's not even going to fuel look at this the guy is not even fueling and he could have parked his damn truck over there or pull forward but he didn't even feel. What a bonehead. You know, it doesn't matter whether this driver is the one who threw that there or not. The bottom line is some driver threw that out there instead of walking a few more feet over to that trash can. Let's not be slobs, guys. Oh, shame on the mess. Welcome to this week's edition of Bonehead Truckers of the Week. This is a place where we make fun of the dumb stuff we see out here on the road. So if you like this kind of garbage, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Share this video to your boyfriends and your girlfriends out there because I look so good. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. I do. And I do not discriminate. Hey, I, if you don't think I look good right here, wait till the end of this video. Okay, the very end, you'll actually see me and you'll really want to share me then. I'm just saying... This week's video is brought to you by Commercial Insurance Associates. CIA is a group of experts in DOT compliance, risk management, safety, driver training, and culture change. CIA clients receive up to 35% off on Keep Trucking and Sam Sarah. Right, yeah, go check them out, cia-trucking.com, and see what they have to offer. All right, give them a call, tell them Bonehead Trucker sent you too. All right. I guarantee you one thing that CIA will not tell you to do is to sit there and just do dumb stuff, right? Like this right here. What do you think you're doing? What do you think you're doing there, big time drunk driver? What do you think you're doing? Oh, you thought you were going to get, hey, you will get around that backup right there and you're going to get up there on the service road, didn't you? Now, you're over there looking dumb. I thought I did a video about this last week. Obviously, this guy wasn't paying no attention. Hey, he just was not paying no attention on bonehead truckers. And once this guy pulling out of the dock, you can already tell what's going on. See how back that trailer is, how far back? He ain't got it. He ain't got it. Look at it. Watch it. While well, you make that turn, and then the dumb looking stuff happens. That's when you start looking dumb. Like Pam right here. Yeah, same thing. Wasn't hooked, probably high hooked on this situation. And, well, that's a good way to screw up your day lots of paperwork and uh hopefully you don't lose your job some 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 places you usually you lose your job because of that man and you know you got this guy thinking that he's gonna go pull out in front of everybody probably didn't see that sign says cross traffic does not stop little jb hunt do the same thing yeah we're gonna just pull out in front of the yeah, don't, don't, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I, I'm just going to pull out here. You guys are going to have to deal with it. That's what J.B. Hunt said. D don't get mad at me. That's what J.B. Hunt said. Oh, look how bumpy this road is. I almost guarantee you this is Louisiana. I, I guarantee you, doggone. It kind of looks like it by the roughness. Actually, this is uh, exit 3 in Greenwood, Louisiana, all 520. Actually, if you are in this neck of the woods, Wascom, Texas, all right, right there on the Texas state line, turn it on 19. You may hear me on the CB radio. That's right. I run a base station right here, and I'll tell you to shut up stupid. That's what I'll tell you to do. Like Prime right here. I'd tell him to shut up stupid if he was all, all up in my radio. Let me tell you what, all right? That's what I'd say. I'm, I'm just saying. Now let's watch this old fella try to, he's in a situation right here. He got himself in a hard, rock in a hard place here. Now he's going to have to figure it out. Let's just sit back and watch. You 
You gonna hit it? You gonna hit the truck? You gonna hit it? Hang on. Oh wait, no. Ah, almost hit him. Now what's he gonna do? Now what's he gonna do? Watch out! No, don't do it! Don't do it! Don't do it! Bam! Doggone shame on that duck fucking mess. Look at there. He says, golly. Now watch how fast he leaves. Like he figures out a way now. It's like, oop. I'm gonna I'm gonna get out of here before someone sees me. Someone sees me. I'm gonna get up on out of here. Watch what happens here. He woke that driver up. <laughs> Look at him. He woke up, he's all bewildered. Like, what just happened here? Look at him. He's like all bewildered. Like, what? What just happened here? <laughs> Doggone. Look at old Swifty Swift right here. He looked like he's stretching. Now listen, God bless this Swift driver. He kind of looks like Donald Trump, like a skinny Donald Trump, actually. But God bless this Swift driver for being so limber. There ain't no way you can get me to do that. I swear, that's a splitting image of a skinny Donald Trump. I bet he's stretching to hit a bridge. What do you guys think? I have to, to, to hit the proper amount of bridges, you got to be nice and stretched. Yes, yeah, sir. Don't, hey, don't hit the ground. You know, someone pissed right there. I'm just saying. All right, so I like this guy right here. Speaking of hitting bridges, looks like this old fella right here. Look like he hit a bridge, and somehow it tells me he's a local driver. He probably knew. He wasn't supposed to be on this road. He thought he was going to go take him a shortcut. Now, now you done, you, you done lost your job. Oh, shame on the mess. That, don't be mad at me. I'm just the reporter right here. That's all I am. I'm covering the Bonehead Truckers news. That's what I'm doing. Here's another angle from a different driver. Golly, why are you doing st stupid stuff like that? Don't it's like you just begging to get on bonehead truckers. Oh My gosh, that's just what we do here on bonehead truckers. We just show the dumb stuff We see out here on the road. Do you like this kind of garbage? Say it in the comments. Say I love this garbage. I just do <laughs> Now check out this guy T too cheap to afford a friggin shower <laughs> All right, I ain't got no shower credits. I, I'd be like feeling sorry for this dude. I'd be saying, hey, I got a shower credit or here's here's a few bucks for a shower. <laughs> Golly. Guys, if you got clips you want to send to see on Bonehead Truckers, send them to con, sorry, <laughs> I had to do that. <laughs> send them to contact at boneheadtruckers.com. My gosh, I was freaking lost it right there. Or join our Facebook group, Say No to Bonehead Truckers. It's a, it's a special link down there in the description. Go check it out. It takes you right to our group. Guys, if you want to support the channel by buying these shirts right here, we'll let you. you. You have permission. You have permission to buy a shirt or two or five. Owner operators, guys, if you're looking for a good company out there, check out TRC Freight. Let them be the right carrier for you. Check them out at trcandme.com. So they got medical benefits that they pay for. You pick your loads. I just don't understand why you're somewhere else and not there, but you know, it's, hey, it's your business. You do what you want to. Guys, thanks for watching today's video, and uh, well, I'll talk to you guys again on Bonehead Truckers.